It's always when I'm running late that this silly coffee maker doesn't work. Oh, come on now. It's because you're not doing it right. Here, let me show you how. Jeremy, I really can handle it on my own. You're gonna break it. Hold on a sec, Dad. I'll help you. Thanks for showing me how it's done. You men think we can't survive without your help, but we'd do just fine without you. Oh, oh don't worry, honey. I'll have it fixed in a jiffy. In a jiffy? Huh. Dad, what mom mean? She could do just fine without us? Don't worry, Elliot. We'll put the coffee maker back together and then she'll be... Mm hmm? Elliot? <laughs> Susie, Mom just said that she could do just Elliot, fine. Elliot, shh. Can't you see him on the phone? Hmm. And don't you come bothering me again. Oh, yeah, definitely. I so agree with you. Boys are useless. I can't wait till we go tonight. It's going to be just us girls. We're just having the best time. <laughs> Aren't you going to school? <gasps> you boys wouldn't know how to get along without us. Huh? I wonder what you'd do if I wasn't around. And don't forget the girls only meeting in the park about our big expedition. It's gonna be so great! Imagine, no boys! <laughs> oh. Hi, Elliot. Oh, are you feeling okay? No, I feel terrible. My mom said she didn't need us men, and now my sister and all the girls in our class are going away on some big expedition. All the girls are packing up to go away to a place without any boys. They're all leaving forever. No more moms, no more sisters, no more girls at all. Oh, how horrible. But so, like, where are they going? to the kingdom of girls. The kingdom of girls! <laughs> Catch a tiger by the toe! You're it! <laughs> to be a way we can stop them. There's a girls only meeting at the park. We gotta go and find out more. But we can't if boys aren't allowed. If we only knew a girl, we could send her to spy on them. Yeah, right, if we only knew a girl. Hey, Mimi, you're a girl. Oh, yeah, of course. But wait, does that mean I have to leave too? I don't wanna go, I wanna stay with you two. You won't have to leave us. You just go on a top secret spy mission to find out what the girls are saying. So we can stop them from leaving. What is she doing? Do you think those girls can tell Mimi's a spy? I really, really hope not. So, you thought you could spy on us without us finding out, huh? <laughs> Traitor! Catch her! Hey, this 
This isn't funny. Mimi is in danger. I'm trying to help her. <laughs> so, uh, where'd you find those clothes? In my sister's wardrobe. <laughs> I'm going in there, K2, and I'm not coming back without Mimi. K2? Huh? Uh, you'll never tell anybody about this, right? Oh, of course not. You're my girl. I mean, uh, my boy. Uh, mm. I mean, my friend. <laughs> Hold on, you here for the girls only meeting? <laughs> the other girls are over at the far end of the park. <laughs> We're all set, our big expedition leaves at 7.30. Oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> we <We're> meet it. <laughs> uh, uh, hello? Hello? <gasps> Why are you hiding in the bushes? Come over here. Are you coming with us tonight? Mm-hmm. Great! So what's your name? Uh... Oh, there you are! <laughs> Hi. I've been looking for you for an hour. Mom's getting worried. Wait, you know this girl? Of course I do. She's my sister. <gasps> Come on, we gotta go home now. You have to, uh, comb your pony. Well, how lucky can you get a pony? I didn't know K2 had a sister. Yeah, even I didn't know. Thanks, K2. I'd have been lost without you. Uh, it's only natural. After all, you're my sister. <laughs> I can't believe it. Mimi's betrayed us. She's going to leave with the girls tonight. Wow. You really can't rely on anyone. I didn't find out where they're leaving from, but I know at what time they're meeting. Mm-hmm. First, we have to follow Mimi and find out where the girls are leaving from. Huh? There she is. Oh. <laughs> Don't let her see us. Huh? Can you believe it? My mom is going with them. All because of the stupid coffee maker. Now I'll never see her again. Or my sister. Princess gowns? Okay. Pony brush? Okay. Jump rope? Okay. Well, I think we're all set. Oh! Huh? <laughs> it's not over yet, Elliot. We still have a chance. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, girls, let's just calm down a bit. The minibus will be here in a few minutes. We've got no other choice now. You're right, Elliot. I think it should work. Uh, you want to do it? Uh, no, you're the specialist. The minivan is here, quick! While the girls are stuck here, we get to the minivan and tell the driver that the trip is off. Wow, Mimi! Yeah, I just remembered. I'm not afraid of mice. No, betrayed by our best friend. Come on, come on. Come on, the van is here. We don't want to be late. We blew it. They're leaving. Please, I promise I'll stop making fun of your stupid, of your girl games. And mom, I'll clean up my room every day. Mimi, you're my best friend as a girl. I promise we won't send you on any more dangerous missions. Susie, I'll carry your book bag. I'll carry all of your book bags. Just please, don't move to the kingdom of girls. Please. <laughs> <laughs> Honey, we're not leaving to go anywhere else. I'm just taking the girls to the Jimmy Jimmy concert. But we'll all be back after the show. I was going to tell you about it this morning, but when the coffee maker broke and made all that mess, I completely forgot. How could you have thought I was going to abandon you? I will never abandon you either, Elliot. Yeah, okay. 
Well, it's getting late, and I guess I should be getting home. Uh, you are home, Elliot. <laughs> I don't want to rush you girls, but the minivan is waiting. Oh, no! I think it's time we try to find the kingdom of boys. <laughs> <laughs>